Hello everyone, we're back to another Magic the Gathering um, box card opening. Card box opening. And this one's Celestia. I actually really start liking Celestia. I'm gonna make a new, um, a new deck. And it's Christmas! What well, was Christmas? Let's open this. Because I don't think anyone likes hearing me talking. Everyone likes to see the action going. It's like those other fellow people always make you listen to the Ooh, the cards. These are always nice to like have. They always give me really good stuff. They never give others really good stuff to me. My friends they really give good stuff to me. So, Let's get started. This is so boring. Oops. Press. Open this thing. Oops. Uh -oh. Oh, yeah, I'm scared. Yeah. I'm scared to bend it. Oh. So let's see what this deck's about. Add one mana to your mana pool. Tap two on top creatures. You can go sacrifice Groove of the Guardian. Put an 8-8 eight, eight green and white creature token. Ooh. Get eight eights from this. Arbor Oath, Untapped Dark Forest, Sacrifice it, you get a 3 3. Populate, you put a 3 3. Ooh, this guy's really good. Or she is quite powerful. I think I get the thing of this deck. You get like big guys like the 8 8, and then you make another of them, and then you make another of them, and you make more of them. Three centaur courses. It's not bad because they're like three threes for three. Three threes for three. And seller of songbirds. One seller of songbirds. So it's basically three mana for a one two and a one one. Hmm. Probably worth the mana. When centaur healer enters the battlefield, you gain three life. That's quite useful because, like, you know, when you have those a lot of tokens, sometimes your opponent has flying guys. Ooh, the rare. Warfaring Temple's power and toughness are each equal to the number of creatures you control. No Warfaring Temple deals way far. Oops. Wafering Temple. You get the populate. Holy moly. That thing's awesome. This thing's amazing. Holy moly. Another. Whoa, this is like super awesome. Like, the card teaming up. Like, teamwork works so well. Because, like, there's. Creature tokens and then the whole deck's about creature tokens. Ooh, six, seven. I like big guys. I like big guys in big decks. Holy moly! An eight, eight. Wait a second. Is this like a token? This is the exact same thing as this one. It's like put an eight, eight green and white. It's green and white. Elemental creature. Elemental. Token. Well, like, not the token part. Vigilance. It's a vigilance guy. That's, that's cool. That's cool. So let's near guild game. Okay. Yeah, and then the lands, and then the lands, and then the lands. I like cool-looking lands. Cool-looking lands are always awesome. I mean, people don't care about lands, but when they look cool, they're awesome. Prevent all dam combat damage that will be dealt to you this turn. Populate. That's really good. Again. Savage Surge. Tiger creature gets plus two, plus two until on the turn. Untap that creature. That's good, too. Two Savage Surge. Two mana for a 3-3 three, three Sendor thing. Now that's good. Heroes Reunion. That's like really good. You just gain seven life for two mana. So let's near Kiva. Two of them. Rootborn Defense. Holy moly. You get to populate. So you can get like another 8-8 eight, eight maybe. Then your creatures are indestructible. Like this deck is just... It's just so good. Until end of turn, target creature gets plus one, plus one for each creature you control and gains trap. Put a white, put a one, one white bird creature token up with flying onto the battlefield. Eyes in the sky. Bountiful harvest, another like, uh, like life thing. Exile target creature, then populate. That's really good. That's really good. Put a green, what, three, three green centaur creature token onto the battlefield, then populate. That's really good. Now let's 
get on to those booster packs. Which one? Which one? Is it? Any, mini, mini. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was thinking. Any, mini, mini. Well, actually, that one looks cool, so I want to save it at the end. Who cares? Any, mini, mini, mo. Catch a tiger by the toe. If you want to lego. Any, mini, mini, mo. That one looks cool. So, let's go. Cross Town Courier. Vediclin. When thing deals combat damage to a player, that player puts that many cards from the top. Holy moly, this goes so well in my friend's deck. Like, that's perfect. As an additional cost to, yeah, you have to sacrifice. Launch party. Destroy target creature's control loses two life. Destroy target creature that dealt damage. That art in here looks so cool. Like, this, these things look so cool. Target creature you don't control gets minus two minus zero to end of turn and attacks this turn if able. You can overload overload it. Trans guild coming! Yay! I finally have one myself. The Adam Manager. Yay! Dagger drone imp. Like I remember, I was just getting pwned by this thing because I had no flying guys, but now a way to counter. Yay, doorkeeper again. Now I have my own of these guys. I have this card. X, add X mana. Is your mana pool with holy? That's really good. <clears throat> you have like this defender. Search for like whoa, three lands. That's really good. Slitherhead. Get to scavenge for nothing. Oh yay, another Vitsugazi guild mage. Oh yes, yes, yes. I love these little 15 cards. It might just be 15 cards, but they're amazing. Like that, 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 just, just perfect. Oh, and this thing, like all of these can go in there. And that, yes, I am definitely happy. If you, if you can, then come not happy. Okay. Ooh, I opened up that. Let's get these. <laughs> Electric ring. That, that's a cool rhyme word. Yes, another of these. Another? Another? 5 3 unleash? Yes, one of these. Grim Bruce Taboot. Regenerate him, and he has unleash. Yay! Tower Drake. It's not too bad. Sun Spire Griffin. Celeste, yay, I can put that in there. Gutter Snipe. <laughs> yes, I got Goblin Rings. He's unlockable. Enters the battlefield to tame creatures you hold. All damage that would be dealt to you or another permanent you control is dealt to police. Holy moly. What's this? An ooh. Still, yay, I got Palisade Giant. That's really cool. There's one problem. If you make it indestructible, it's like the best card in the world. But it's not. But it has seven life. So that's not bad. That's not bad. Refusing Guild of Giants. She fights for those who can protect themselves. This is, I, I just, I just love these. These are perfect. Like, I don't know even which one was better. I, I have to say, like, no offense to you, Booster Pack. I like this one, because this one goes in there. Well, that one does too, but, like, no offense, I like that one a lot. I want to count how many lands there is. Actually, you know what? This is going to tell me. It should tell me. This is the right one. It tells you the cards you get in the other ones. It's just... Just, just, no, wait, oh, there's 12 in, oh, that's so fine. Rakdos Spade, is it, 
ingenuity. Holy moly, there's like, like there's more spells than creatures in that one. That's because it isn't. Is it only comes one spell? To me. To me. Maybe not. To, oh, that one does too. That one has like, that one was really good. I like that one. I like this one. This one's awesome. Rakdos Raid. I'll, I'll show you what makes the deck better. All you need to add is this one card, and then your deck is amazing, and then this is it's more amazing, and then this is it's more amazing, and that is it's more more amazing, and then it's just, 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 it's too good. It's too good. This is this is amazing. This this is big. This means a lot to me. I was actually thinking of giving these packs away when I got them. I was like, should I give these away? And now I regret it. Oh, it's so boiling in here. I'm like sweaty. Oh well, that was a good pack. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.